right, so 20 is a function, oh, 20 is a problem that's asking us about function composition and find the domain. So we have two functions. We have f of x is log base 2 of x. And we have that g of x is x squared minus 4. So we want to find the domain of f of g. So what's the domain of f of g? So remember that to do the do, uh, to do a function composition, we're going to take our inner function and plug it into our outer function. But remember that you always look for the domain before you simplify. So here, f of g of x is going to be log base 2 of, and then instead of x, we're going to plug in the entire g of x function. We get x squared minus 4. Okay, so what we need to do here is think about what is our domain restriction. Well, we have a logarithm. So remember that any, when you do the log of any number, that number has to be strictly greater than zero. So this domain restriction becomes that x squared minus 4 has to be a positive number. Because you can't take the log of zero, and you can't take the log of any negative numbers. So... We just need to figure out, when is this true? Well, this one's pretty easy to figure out instead of by solving it all out. Just think about it here. This is exactly equal to 0 when x is 2 or negative 2. It's going to be bigger than 4, like if x is 3, that certainly works, because then that would be a positive number. Or if it's negative 3, that works. So anything that's outside of negative 2 and 2 works. So our domain here is going to be anything from negative infinity up to negative 2, but we're going to have a parenthesis because we can't use 2 and negative 2 because those would give us exactly 0, which doesn't work. Union 2 to infinity. So anything that is uh, inside, or anything that is not in the interval negative 2 to 2, and we can't use the points negative 2 to 2 themselves. So that would be answer choice E here. <laughs>